This exhibition is in the context of the 2018 Architecture Biennale, and we are exhibiting as a school, telling really the story of the School of Architecture and Planning, what drives us, and in turn, how we act in our community and in our city. Buffalo has had its ebbs and flows, but I think we're in this space of revitalization where there's a lot of pride for Buffalo and a lot of passion to be building and making. We are a school that is very driven by place and we respond to the complexity of the history of the city of Buffalo. In the year 1900, it was home to more millionaires per capita than any other city in the U.S. Uh, it's a city that was, you know, dreamed big and built boldly. Of course, the second half of the 20th century brought a sharp decline to the city. We've lost more than half of our population over that time, um, which means that there's a, there are a lot of questions about how to rethink the city in the 21st century. The best laboratory in the world is the one right outside your door. So we work and learn with our host community. We have this city that we really use as a workshop for practice as a school. We have these sites that are kind of asking for intervention in some way. It means that students are able to design and build and then install those pieces throughout the city of Buffalo. So the city drives us as a school, uh, but then we in turn are driving the city. We are in Venice at the Palazzo Bembo and we are in the exhibition of Time, Space and Existence and I'm a part of the team for See It Through Buffalo, a documentary of our school and the city of Buffalo and how each are rooted within each other. The exhibition shows some of Buffalo's best and most challenging conditions. The curation of this film has been a joint effort between John Paget and Paget Films and our faculty and students. Every segment of the film describes uh, some aspect of our scholarship, of our learning, and our fully engaged work in the community. Not as a promotion, but as an inquiry. How do we bring a city not back to what it was, but what it needs to be in the future? This film gives us a chance to really share Buffalo uh, with the world. What people find is it's a more complex city than they might have realized. The questions we're asking are questions of profound global significance. That's why we are Buffalo in Venice now. I'm an advocate for the University of Buffalo. I'm very proud to be from there. And this film is a tangible way of expressing that to other people. People can see through this exhibition the muse-like quality of the relationship between our enterprise as architectural educators and students of architecture and the communities that host us. So us working in the city and the city contributing back in ways that we all learn together, that's what it's about.